How are we? I'm tired. I'm struggling. Life's hard. Do you know what I'm struggling with more than anything? And it's been driving me insane, to be honest, right? So I've had this car now six months. 90% of my driving, maybe 95, depending on how busy I am, is home charged. Seven and a half people kilowatt, two people mile. Lovely jubbly. Outside of that, five to ten percent is rapid charge. Now, I didn't know this, and the reason I'm doing this video is because I, I know that people that don't won't know this, and it's very important while choosing what electric car you go for and why. So there's two types of charges. I'm gonna put them up now. There should be a picture. I might edit it in later, I might forget. There should be a picture. And you got a one charger is a type two. And then the other one is a, I think it's a CCS charger, type two. And it's got and it's the same charger, but it's got the additional two ports underneath that charger. Now that's the one that brings in the rapid, like ultra fast charging, right? So on my Tesla Model S, uh, my 2018 plate, and it's uh, it's only got a type two charger. Right, and I didn't know the difference. I didn't even know there's different connections, whatever, when I bought this. I was a new baby in the EV world. Um, now, the difference between the Type 2 and the CCS Type 2 is, for one, the Type 2 charges a lot slower. And also, it's like old tech. So, the new CCS, that's new tech. So, all the new... Uh, charges popping up, all the new Tesla superchargers popping up, all these BP charges and the grid serves and the pods and all of them are coming up with this new rapid charger tech CCS connector. There's little old me in a Type 2 charger. So, uh, yesterday I had a job up to the lakes, but I'd done about three other jobs before then. Airports back and forth to Man Air. It was a dead busy day, over 400 mile in one day. And then once I got about 45 mi miles away from, I'll show you the picture in a sec, away from the drop, there's a Tesla supercharger, a Type 2 one. And then I've got to drop off and get back to the same charger. So it was a 90 mile round trip to this Tesla, te te uh, Type 2 Tesla charger, rapid charger. So I had to stop with customers. <laughs> it was terrible. There was sound about it, but I had to stop with customers, and it was just a joke, really. And it was starting to do me head in. So when I'm super busy, this Type 2 charger scenario and, and the lack of charges is killing me. Now, I'm going to show you the picture. Yeah, it should show up. There's two pictures. Like one is the available Type 2 rapid chargers on the map, and the other one is the available CCS charges rapid charges on the map now the ccs ones are all different makes and models bp pod tesla all of them show up on this map can you see the difference and what you're dealing with with the type 2 only and like i said i didn't know this existed and like and um, the good thing is i charged today in tesla and that's why i'm doing the video and I was talking to the fella, the staff, and I was like, and explaining him, like, I was like, oh, mate, it's, doing, it's really struggling at the moment with charges and finding them. And he went, what, what are you doing? He went, uh, Mod Less. He went, old one, type two. And yeah, yeah. And he went, why don't you just get the, uh, <laughs> this, is what, this is what I'm telling you, why don't you just get the adapter? And what do you mean? And he went, we do an adapter since we changed the, the charger to CCS. All old Model S's and Model X's, there's an adapter. I think you, you, you contact Tesla and, um, you contact Tesla, and between two and three hundred quid, he didn't know the exact price. Uh, they'll come out to your house. They'll give you the adapter and reprogram your car to show the CCS charges. And I'm like, mate, I've had this car for like nearly six months, and I didn't know. He went, yeah, yeah. So how good's that? So that's one. If you've got an old Tesla with the Type Two, there's that to your adapter. That's that easy to get. Just contact them through the app. And the option two. There's still an old amount of char air cars that are on Type 2 only that might not have adapters. So when you're buying a full electric car, just make sure they're on the C 
CCS, whatever the charger port is, with the rapid charging. Because I'm telling you, if you're going to rely on rapid charging, or at least need it as a backup, you need that flipping charger type. I was honest to God, it's been wrecking my head. I've been close to like, swapping the car for a newer Tesla or a Hyundai or whatever with this charger port because it just restricts me so much, this uh, Type 2 one. And uh, yeah, that's it really. Honestly, I was gutted. And then when he told me today I was made up, I was like, oh, go ahead then. So two, three hundred quid. I can get an adapter so I can charge there. He's like, yeah. He went, you won't get the super fast charge like the old guy. He went, but at least you'll be able to charge at them all. I was like, sad. So I'm going to get it, I think. There's uh, third party ones you can get from eBay and Amazon. But I'm not risking the batteries or the software by putting a black one in from China or whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm mad at that. Because <laughs> um, obviously, if you compare them, like just say I get a Tesla Model 3 now, a new one, brand new one, with the CCS charger. It can go from like 0 to 90%, 90, 90%. Percent in literally 10 15 minutes now, they are so quick. We're mine from like 0 to 90 percent, so probably take about 45 minutes at a rapid charger just because my car's old tech and it just takes a lot longer to charge than the new stuff and the new connectors and stuff like that. And um, but yeah, that's it, guys. Make sure if you're gonna buy an electric car, make sure it hasn't got the type 2 only charger, it's got the CCS charger. All right, listen, nice one for watching as per usual, and I'm gonna show you. A little something that you need to watch because it's a brand new thing that's launched and we need to get our drivers some work. So enjoy. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Catch you later. Don't forget, there's a brand new website out. I don't even heard about it. DM Airport Transfers. Go to drivermatty.com and book your airport transfer.